uh, I used the do while uh, loop. So uh, it will loop if the user wants to order again or no. So in the in the first page, it will print this particular uh, code, which is the welcome to Lucas vending machine. Well, it will ask the user to insert their money and make them choose between these categories, which is the candies, the chips, the beverage, biscuits, and water. After the user um, picks one of these categories, um, for example, the user picks the candy. I used the switch statement uh, to switch between um, these categories, these five categories. For the first category, if the user enters one, it will print the candy menu box, which is the categories of candies where there are different kinds of uh, candies and chocolates. I also added this system CLS to um, print this exact code on the other page. So this will not show up. So after this, um, if the user pick candies, which is the number one, um, it will ask the user again what chocolate or candy they want um in this menu then if the user picks one of this uh i use the if else statement for returning the change and um displaying the sentence the item has been dispensed so it all works to uh every candy in here in this menu box there it will uh, subtract the price to the user's money after that um, this will print the do you want to order again to partner the one you just ordered this will print in the after this, your change will be uh, this. It will print also this one, which will ask the user if they want to order again. And if the user press um, Y, the whole code will uh, loop, uh, asking them to order again. Well, if the user enters no or N, the code will print this thank you for your purchase hope you will buy again but if the user um pick uh in the categories in here in categories if he pick um a number higher than five or a number lower than one um this statement will print which is invalid input please try again and this one, if the user enter uh, a money, enters his or her money, and shows a big price like this Haribo gummy bear, and his or her money is not enough, this will print that, sorry, you don't have, not have enough money to proceed this transaction. And it will actually return the user's money so let's see how it will work there then as you can see, 
it transferred into another page where it's uh, letting me choose in this um, menu box.